In this video, we will show you how to use Minitool Movie Maker, the video editor with an easy to understand interface. With the Minitool Movie Maker, we can cut, trim, add audio, add evac, motion, transition, or etc. Before you use the Minitool Movie Maker, you need to install them. You can see our previous video how to install the Minitool Movie Maker. For the first time, you can open your Minitool Movie Maker after the installation is complete to create new project. Please wait until this option is appear. After that, you can just click new project to create new projects. You can import media files like video, audio, image, or etc. here. Okay, just open or select one or more video. You can click open after that. Like I say, what makes the Minitool Movie Maker is easier to understand, okay, because they separate one video and the second video and the third video and etc here. For example, if we have three video, we can just add the video look like this. So, the video is have a space that it's clear to add transition after or before the video like for example we can just add transition okay you can see here we can play by clicking this option okay and how to add transition you can just click this and select for example you have this and you can just drag look like this you can see here And also, you can cut the video. For example, you need to cut the video in here. You can just click this. So, after you cut the video, it will also have a space look like this that you can easy to put anything like transition here. So, it's clear where is the first video, second video, and so on in here. In here, for example, you can also add evac. For example, I have the flame flow. Then you can drag the effect to the video and you can see the result like this. Okay, if you think the effect is not enough, you can just add the filters. For example, because we add the flame in here, we just add the effect for filters look like this. So, your video will look like this after that. Okay, you can also add audio here for free. You can just click audio and you can preview the audio one by one. For example, you can preview the audio by hovering in them. After you choose the right audio, you can just click add here. Make sure the cursor is point into you want. Okay, for example, you can just click this plus add button and you can see the result. Also, you can adjust the speed for the video. For example, you can cut the video in here. Just click this. I'm sorry, you need to activate on your video here. And select the part of the video that you want. Just click the split. And for example here, you can select the video properties. Okay, you can adjust the speed by clicking this. Or you can also rotate the video okay you can also select color for the contrast saturation and brightness but I will make this default value we need to adjust the speed for example we need to make it slower okay. 
Let's see our video. Okay, I think it's too slow. You need just adjust. Look like this. You can see here. You got it. And in here, you can also add the text. Okay, for example, if you have trademark or important text, you can just adding this. For example, you can just drag the text look like this. Okay, for example, this is your text. I will put where data here. And you can adjust the shape and the image or text. And you can adjust the color of the text here. And, and you can preview after that. If this tag is not suitable with a unit, you can select another style here. For example, credit, titles, and there are more categories and more text style here. You can find the suitable with you. Okay, after the video is complete, you can just export them. How to export the video? You can just click export button here. Okay. Just click export button. And for example, you can adjust the resolution frame rate. And also you can select device. For example, you can select for iPhone, smartphone, Galaxy Note, or ETC here. And if you are using PC, just select PC here. Select the resolution you need and select frame rate you need also. Then click export. After the export is complete, you can click find target. Okay. And this is the video results. You can just open it. Because we don't cut anything. Okay, and that's all tutorial how to use mini tool movie maker on Windows 11 the video editor with easy to understand interface thanks for watching hope the video helpfully for you